On today's episode of Multimeter Training, we're going to discuss an amp meter. An amp meter is the meter's ability to measure current. Our multimeter today has the ability to read up to 10 amps, meaning anything above that you try to read, you're going to blow the internal fuses. We have a small circuit board here we're going to use to demo how to use the amp meter in this multimeter. The first thing we have to do is set the meter up properly. The black, it stays in the common, but the red lead, we're going to move over here to our 10 amp position there and we're going to turn the dial to the 10 amp range. Now that our meter set up we can do the check. All it is is again a 9 volt battery inside. We have a switch and goes up here to a small little pilot light. We can simply turn the switch on and our light comes on. We know it works so we're going to turn that back off. Now we're going to use our multimeter to connect the circuit. We're going to go on both sides of the light switch posts here and when I connect them you'll see the light came on. And you can look at the display right now, it says it is pulling 0.159 amps. The way this works is, before we used our switch to connect this point to this point, now instead of using the switch, we're going to use our meter. Go on one side of the switch, it's going to flow through the red lead, through the meter, come back out the black lead, and complete the circuit. That way, again, all the current is flowing through our meter. A lot of times technicians ask me, why would I ever need to know that? Well, this is the same way you would hook up on a truck to check for a parasitic load. This is a very easy way you can check on your batteries. Is something staying on, pulling the batteries down? Or if not, it's got to be a battery issue causing the problem. 